Welcome to Streaming the Legs. My name is Mr. And, and that's the yeah the sequel of this very very successful 8-bit uh, shovel knight. And it's coming the 20th. Oh, that's so weird. I think that's the wrong date. <laughs> 26th of June in 2014. Oh my God, my friend. So it comes on the 10th of December. So in two days, yeah. And, and and it looks like it has a, as a shovel of hope is the is the sequel name and it looks like it has more of everything else so more of more levels more enemies a little bit better 8-bit graphics so but that's already real limited it's 8-bit so that's actually very interesting how can you make the graphics better of an 8-bit game uh, without uh, making a 16-bit game but you still stay an 8-bit game, so that's awesome. So yeah, the developers right. Shovel Knight is a sweeping classic action-adventure game with awesome gameplay, memorable characters and an 8-bit retro aesthetic. If you love games with perfect platforming, beautiful art, oh, that's awesome. They took the text of the old uh, Shovel Knight. I love this. <laughs> so if you own Shovel Knight Treasure Trove, that's the first one. You will not need to purchase Shovel Knight Shovel of Hope separately. This title is included with all versions of Shovel Knight Treasure Trove. Okay, okay, now now, now the confusion, my friends, now confusion. Mr. Orange has Shovel Knight, so played it a little bit. <laughs> okay, that's awesome, guys. I get it even for free. So that's Shovel Knight, it came out in uh, 2014. So therefore the text is the same. Okay, let's let's jump back. So, okay, if you own Shovel Knight Treasure Trove, you will not need to purchase it. Shovel Knight Shovel of Hope separately. This title is included with all versions of Shovel Knight Treasure Trove. I repeated it. So it comes in two days. Even I can play it. I don't have to purchase it because I have the previous version. Therefore, that's the text. Okay, okay, okay. Ah, that's even better. So I just found out I get some free game. That's awesome. Shovel Knight is awesome. Classic features, features, features. Okay, okay. Then I would say we, we check the discussion board because it's a little, there's a little confusion here. Yeah, Clap, what are you doing? Uh, is this sequel or not? I'm confused here because I was pretty sure that I just got the game called Shovel Knight. If clip baiting cut the crap either. Oh my god, I can't read this. It's a standalone version of the main campaign. If you have treasure trove, you already own Shovel Knight, Shovel of Hope. In my opinion, it's pretty dumb. Let us get the treasure version, as all four knights didn't understand why they only released just the Spectre version. The main thing that to doubt here is why they would even release it as a standalone now, rather than around the time of Spectre of Torment's release, when they first invoked the idea of extra standalone releases. It doesn't come across as a concept Yacht Club Games actually believes in as in one that will help them reach a wider audience. If anything, it feels like a cheap attempt at trying to trick customers into purchasing into something they don't fully understand, leading to a later repurchase. Yeah, there's a strong allegations, my friend, but uh, it's confusing, it's confusing. I have to admit, for me, just it's confusing. I don't know now, read not all of the news, so. I guess it's confusing for all of you too. It's literally in bold letters on the top of the about section. They aren't tricking anyone, that's true. I get it for free. I don't have to pay for this. So. I know that I'm saying they shouldn't divide in content like that and I don't know. Okay, this guy, I'm not reading his corner. His, uh, <laughs> okay, he's the only guy that wrote something but uh, you can't really understand it. Well, 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 my friend, so. I mean, I clarified this for you now. Shovel of Hope, you get it for free if you have if you have the previous one here. If you have Treasure Trove, the first one, if you bought this already, you get Shovel of Hope for free on Steam. How it is on other platforms, I can't tell you, but I guess it's going to be the same. So in this regard, don't purchase it because you have it then, I guess, for free in your library. All right, I hope this clarified a little bit this confusion about about Shovel of Hope. Also, I clarified it for myself, at least. And then I'm leaving this video here and wish you a wonderful day, my friends. Bye bye.